Hey everyone, welcome to another autograph wrap up. Today I'll be showing you guys the uh, cards that I was able to get signed by the San Diego Padres this past weekend in spring training. First up we have Chan Ho Park. Chan Ho is in camp with the Padres as uh, some sort of an advisor. I'm not sure exactly what he does, but uh, normally you can see him walking around with his uh, entourage. Uh, Usually he's pretty nice about signing. Uh, he signs one per. This weekend I had my kids with me and they were able to help me get a few more done. But uh, when my kids uh, went up to get his autograph, he actually told them that he was Hideo Nomo and that these weren't his cards. But my kids knew better, so they were able to get them signed for me. So first up we have one of his fun ones uh, from the 2003 Donruss Studio. It's kind of a cool looking photo. Chan Ho said he's never actually seen this card. Uh, it's his Oryx Buffaloes cards from a uh, card from Japan. I don't know how many Japanese cards he actually has or if this is the only one or not, but it's still kind of cool to get that card signed. And then one of his earlier Stadium Club cards with the Dodgers. Next we have Josh Naylor. Uh, this dude's been pretty tough for me uh, in the past to get an autograph from, but it seems like this year in spring training he's kind of nicer, and he's actually signing for adults. Uh, he personalizes everything, which no big deal. Uh, ended up getting this one done for my buddy, uh, Joey. And then my son, Carter, was able to get another one done. So, I mean... If he didn't personalize them, it looks like he would kind of have a plain autograph anyway, so it kind of makes it interesting. Here we have uh, another one of the Padres' top prospects, because uh, I believe the Padres were voted their farm system was number one overall, and this is one of the reasons why. Luis Arias, uh, he gets mobbed every time he uh, signs, but uh, having the kids there with me, they were able to get me one, uh, an extra one signed up by him. Next we have Tyson Ross. Uh, he's back with the Padres this year. Uh, he's usually pretty good about signing after he's done with his uh, bunting drills. So you can get him. Next up is Will Myers. I've gotten him a lot this year in spring training. Uh, he's signed anywhere from one to three cards for me. Uh, and he's usually really good about signing after he's done with batting practice and everything. Uh, another reason why the Padres farm system is so good, uh, Anderson Espinosa. So I was able to get, I believe three, yeah, three cards signed by him. Next up we have Buddy Reed. Uh, he's kind of tough. Sometimes he likes to sign, sometimes he doesn't. And when he does, it's one per. Clayton Richard, uh, I believe he's going to be the Padres opening day starter. So I was able to get one done of him. Still have a lot more cards that I need to try and get. But he, he usually only signs one per. Next we have Craig Stamen. I was actually pretty happy to get this guy because uh, I've never gotten his autograph before. So it's always nice to add cards to the collection of people that you never had before. Uh, another one of their prospects uh, that I never, was never able to get before, Adrian Morjohn. Not the best autograph, but uh, he signed four cards for me. So it's nice to get those all out of the way. Next we have Moise Salou. He's a, an instructor, I guess, with the Padres. He's been there for the past few years. I don't know if he uh, helps out with any of the uh, teams during the season uh, or once the season starts, but he's always there in spring training. Uh, but... I really like how these cards turned out. Pretty nice. I was able to get uh, another Luis Perdomo. Add that to the collection. 
Now, one of the uh, cool things about this type or this time of year in spring training is that the minor league teams uh, start filling out their rosters. And the day we went to the Padres camp, uh, the Texas Rangers minor leaguers were playing them. So these are kind of like bonus autographs I was able to get. Uh, so I had uh, one of Anderson Tejada. Matthew Watley had one of him. Spike Owen uh, played in the bigs for a really long time. He's a, uh, I believe he's the double A coach now with uh, in the Texas Rangers system. One of the Rangers top prospects, Leody Tavares. I was able to get two done by him. Kind of happy how this pro debut here turned out because those cards have been causing me lots of problems this year. Then we have uh, the Rangers' top prospect, Willie Calhoun. Uh, nice guy. Just has a really horrible autograph. But uh, Like I said, he's super nice. And he uh, ended up signing four cards for me. And, uh, so it, it wasn't like a, a bad day with, uh, about 30 autographs. And then we were also able to get a Major League Baseball signed by Takashi Saito. He, uh, signed it in English and Japanese for us. He's a, he's also an instructor with the Padres. Uh, so he's a super nice guy. So thanks everyone for watching. And if you, uh, have time, go check out the Trump City Autographs, uh, Facebook page. I post a lot of stuff on there that I don't make videos about, so thanks.